So I've been gone for a while. I missing out on reviews for Gravity and Anchorman 2, but I'm gonna do one for the Wolf of Wall Street right now. And pretty soon I'm gonna get back to old movies. I wanna do Fight Club, Pulp Fiction and stuff, cause those are some of my favorite movies. So um, Shawshank Redemption and stuff. So um, I'm gonna be doing reviews on those pretty soon. Fuck. Leonardo DiCaprio and Jonah Hill play awesomely in the Wolf of Wall Street. Leonardo DiCaprio plays as Jordan Belfort. And um, Jonah Hill plays as this guy called Donnie. I forgot his last name, but it's Donnie. And um, the movie's funny. It's kind of like a comedy, but it, it is a comedy, but it's really serious also. It's a really, it's a three hour long movie. It's really long. But I think every minute of the movie is worth it. This movie entertained me so much. I, I was in the movie theaters and I was stuck. My eyes were stuck to the screen the whole time. I love this movie. It was such a good movie. And right after the movie, I even went as far to say it is one of my favorite movies I've ever seen. Possibly the best. But I guess that was just in the heat of the moment. Um, It's not the best movie I've ever seen. I don't really have a favorite movie or the best movie I've ever seen, in my opinion. Um, I just like, I like some movies. But I don't think that I have one movie that stands out like overall. Uh, there's some great movies. But The Wolf of Wall Street is definitely one of them. I watched this movie with a few friends and we all kind of agreed that this movie was so awesome. We watched it for three hours straight. Our eyes, we didn't talk to each other at all throughout the three hours because we were just so into the movie. It's a funny movie. It's really awesome. It's a really serious movie. And you're just seeing a whole bunch of douchebags getting rich. Yes, Leonardo DiCaprio is a douchebag in this movie. You can see it. He, he kind of says it too that he's an asshole in this movie. And it's funny too, I mean, him and the funniest part in the movie is when him and Jonah Hill do a whole bunch of drugs. And um, you can see how much of a douchebag he is by he just acting out all crazy in front of his 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 daughter. And so, I mean, it's pretty crazy, but it's hilarious. Jonah Hill is really funny in this movie. Um, so He's sort of annoying, but he's really funny. He's really awesome. I think Jonah Hill has gone from being a pretty good actor to an amazing actor throughout the years. He's really been in some serious stuff, and Leonardo DiCaprio, in my opinion, has always been in such an amazing actor, top notch. But um, this movie was really awesome. I really did enjoy it. It's based on a true story, and apparently, it's really accurate. But um, I really did enjoy this movie. There hasn't really been a movie that I can say that I've enjoyed as much as The Wolf of Wall Street this whole year, besides Gravity and Anchorman 2. Those were really awesome. I have not seen The Hunger Games yet. I really want to watch it, but um, I've seen. Captain Phillips, I forgot about that. That was a really good movie also. 12 Years of Slave was really awesome. So yeah, definitely The Wolf of Wall Street was amazing. It was spectacular. It was outstanding. I love The Wolf of Wall Street so much. It was such a great movie. The Wolf of Wall Street is outstanding. I am telling you. This movie was such a great movie. And this is why I'm saying that The Wolf of Wall Street is outstanding. This movie was just great i love this movie it was such a great movie as soon as i it comes out i'm gonna buy it on blu-ray and i just want to watch this movie again it was such a great movie i showed it to my parents they they they, they loved it and um it is three hours long i wouldn't advise that you let people who aren't into it this movie has a lot of nudity and it has a lot of use of drugs if you can deal with stuff like that like that graphic this movie will you will have a blast with this movie. I have not met a single person who disliked this movie yet. It was such a great movie. And I really advise you all watch it because it was such a show. I loved this movie. Once again, it was just a roller coaster of a ride. I was never bored throughout the movie. So I hope you guys enjoyed this review on The Wolf of Wall Street. It was a great movie. I just want you guys to go watch it. Again, great movie. So um, I hope you guys really did enjoy it. I will have a Metal Gear Solid Peace Walker review pretty soon. I have to finish it up again because it broke on my 360. So I have to go on my PS3 now and play that shit. I'll have it before Metal Gear Solid 5 comes out. Of course, I'm not going to play that when Metal Gear 5 is out. I'm going to beat that game. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys did, as always, leave a like, favorite, or subscribe. And...